All right, guys, welcome back for another video from TDL DIY. So today we're going to be looking at this Xbox right here. Um, a little bit hard to see because it's black and it's on a black surface, but this Xbox here, Xbox 360, um, obviously it's missing uh, the door there, it's missing the front piece. Uh, so there's some things that are missing on this. Uh, so today we're going to replace this little piece for the CD drive. And basically what this is, is a, it's, it's a spot where you put the, the game in and it holds it from spinning around, just gives it a little seat. So we're going to go ahead and take this apart. Uh, be warned that obviously we've already noticed that it's missing some things. Um, and we're going to uh, take it apart as much as we can. It might be missing some uh, items. Um, and it's already kind of taken apart, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. That's what we got here and this is what we're going to be replacing right here so I'm going to compare the two so here's the two um, as you can see this one is missing this nice flat surface the black surface um, which will get installed like that uh, so we're going to take that off it's got some really I think three micro screws in the back and uh, down here, so one, two, and three up there. We're gonna take those out. As you can see, uh, right here, one, two, and the third one's missing, unfortunately, but two will hold. So what we're gonna do for this, uh, to get this ribbon off, we're gonna pull it back, just like that. That little white thing, pull this out. And we're going to get some micro screwdrivers to get that off. Got this guy out. So basically what happened when uh, this was installed, uh, you can't put a seat on it. And if you do, then it just spins and throws the, the game all over the place. So this is the new one. We're going to throw it in. Feed it the same way. Just like that. So now we're going to put the ribbon in. And the ribbon's uh, installed correctly. So now we're just going to put it back together. And I'll get a power source um, a little bit after. And we'll test to see if it spins and everything works. So.
guys for watching. If you uh, enjoyed this Xbox 360, we changed out the elastic band in there. I just used a regular elastic band for that one uh, to make the tray come out. Uh, you just have to have a really small one. I'll show you downstairs in a second kind of what size. Alright guys, so uh, this is the original uh, Xbox uh, elastic um, band. And this is the size of one I put in there. You can tell it's quite a bit smaller. But if you stretch this out, um, it'll fit between the two pulleys. And uh, it works quite nicely. This one doesn't have a lot of stretch. That's why. Um, but if you're using a regular elastic band, see? Stretch quite big. It makes a nice tight fit, um, so that's what I recommend. If you have a really small one, you just stretch it, it works perfect. So that's a lot better than just buying um, the Xbox uh, 360 uh, pretty much elastic bands to open the tray. Um, if you want a video on that, let me know, and uh, I'll do another video on how to fix the tray. Pieces of plastic, which doesn't really affect the op operation of it. I just wanted to make sure that it worked, test that it worked and uh, it, it can read the game no problem because uh, without me knowing originally the first time I put an, a game in there and it just spun around like crazy and it sounded really bad and I opened it up and I realized uh, it was missing the, the little plastic uh, tray for it so um, yeah guys thanks for watching if uh, you like this stuff feel free to give it a thumbs up if you haven't already subscribe and uh, you can always leave a comment down below tell me what you thought or uh, possibly any videos you'd like to see in the future. Um, I'm open to suggestions, even though I have a kind of a, a little bit of a plan of what my next video might be, but uh, I'll take suggestions and definitely think about putting on my list of uh, things to do. So I appreciate all the support, guys. Thanks for watching, and don't forget, never stop learning.